In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a really awesome glitch text effect right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So let's get right into it. So once you've got Adobe Premiere Pro open, we can begin by generating some new text. So we'll go up to File, New, Legacy Title. We'll press OK on this menu. And inside of the Legacy Title window, we can begin by generating some new text. So I'm just going to type out the word glitch. We'll change the font to a veneer. We'll change the, the weight of this to black. We'll increase the size. We'll center this up by using these two buttons on the left. And then we'll just exit this window. Now we'll drag this title onto video layer one. We'll extend the duration over to the right. So we'll add a few more seconds onto this. And then we'll go into effects, search for RGB color balance and we'll drop the color balance RGB onto the text layer. Now from here, we need to make multiple copies of this clip. So we'll hold option on the keyboard and drag title one up to, up to video track two, and then title two up onto video track three. So we should have three versions of that text. Now on video layer three, we'll select the title and we'll go into color balance and change the green and blue to zero. On video layer two, we'll go onto the text, go into color balance RGB and change red and blue to zero. And then on video layer one, we'll change the text. So we'll change the green and the red both to zero. And then on video layer two, we'll go up into opacity, into blend mode, and we'll change the blending mode from normal to screen. And then we'll go up to video layer three and we'll do the same thing again. So we'll change the blend mode on video layer three from normal to screen and the text should become white. And if it doesn't go white, then make sure you've got all of the settings that I just mentioned. Make sure everything is exactly the way that I just said. Now, as you can see, if I move the position of the top text layer over to the left or to the right, you've got this really cool glitching effect happening. Again, the same thing happens on the second track if I move that over to the right. And basically what we need to do to do this glitching effect is animate the position, the scale, the rotation to just very quickly nudge over to the left or to the right to increase the scale very quickly to rotate a little bit. So we'll begin with the position and on video layer three, we'll select the text layer, create a brand new keyframe on position, go to the right four keyframes and another four keyframes, create a brand new keyframe. We'll go back four and we'll pull the position over to the right just a little bit. And we play this back. We've got this really subtle glitch. Now, if you go in between the first set of keyframes and move this over to the left and then go in between the second set of keyframes and move that over to the left, you've got this really cool shuddering glitch effect, which looks really cool. Again, though, this is very subtle, so we're going to add some scale. We'll create a brand new keyframe at the start and at the end. And then in the middle, we'll increase the scale up to around 107 pixels. We'll go back one keyframe, reduce this to around 97. We'll go in between the second set of keyframes, pull this back down to around 99. And when we play this back, we've got this really cool, very subtle glitch text effect happening. Now, of course, if you want this to be more noticeable and more extreme, then all you have to do is just increase the values of these keyframes. So rather than just increasing to 107, you can increase to 120 or 150. It's completely up to you. Now, from here, we'll move down to rotation. So we'll create a brand new keyframe on rotation at the beginning of all of those other keyframes. We'll create one at the end. We'll move to the middle and we'll rotate this to around 6%. Now we'll go in between those second set keyframes. We'll pull this to negative three and we'll go in between the first set keyframes and do the same thing. And there you go. We've got this really cool rotating glitch effect. But of course, we've done all of these effects on the first text layer. If we were to do this on the second text layer, so the text on video layer two, we would have the glitch effect, but it would be a slightly different color. So as you can see, if I'm updating the position, we've got more of a green, purple and yellow tone rather than red and blue coming through. And again, if we did this to the title on the video layer one, we would also have another color coming through. So go through the position, the scale and the rotation on all of these different title layers, adjust these, create keyframes and begin creating your glitching text effects right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then don't forget to subscribe to see more. Click this box if you want to see the previous video and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. Thank you for watching.